Hello, another quick review of something I've printed with my Trunksy 600. This time it was just the vase mode to see whether the layer shifts occur and whether there's a problem with with the set axis or whatsoever. I'm just trying to um, figure out what the problem might be with the layer shift. And this is just one easy way to make sure that everything is fine on the set X. So I printed this one in base mode and it really worked out nice for me. So the print is really smooth. It's layer height 0, 5. You can see this here. So I don't have any problem at all with the quality of this print. Um, yeah, this worked out really nice. So I also then, with this print, I emptied my 8 kilo spool up there. So it's time for another one. I managed to print those big products with this and my snare, my white one, and this vase. And it's a really good print, as you can see here, vase mode. Can you see anything? Uh, yeah. Really nice. I'm really surprised by the strength of this. It was a 0.8 nozzle, and it's a 0. Point, it's supposed to be 0 0.8 wall thickness, and 0 0.1, uh, 0 0.5 layer height. Looks really nice for me. Uh, I changed my extruder to a Bontech, as you may see here. And also with the all metal, um, not a hot end, but a heat break. Yes, and a new nozzle that thinks you should swap from time to time. Yeah, but the Bontech just really, yeah. I don't know whether it made an issue, but I wasn't convinced by the normal Tronchi one. And I also, maybe you can see this one here, I moved the motor over the very right corner without any thing in between. So on the right side, there's all the weight from the gantry. And yeah, I just wanted to reduce all kinds of stress on the y-axis. That's why I did this one. So, and I also worked on the on the bell tension again and so on. That's normal maintenance. So that's all for today. Leave your comments, leave your questions. Have a good day.